Wobbly Camera Guy video. Have you ever wanted to create that video in text effect? Perhaps you're making a YouTube video and you like the intro just to stand out just that little bit more. And I'm going to show you a very, very easy way to do this. And this is utilizing both the combination of HitFilm Express and Canva. So let's get started. So in my timeline, got a simple video clip. And I'd like to make a video in text effect for this clip. So off we go. First of all, we need to jump to Canva. So here we are in Canva. For those of you who have not used Canva before, it's an excellent website. With it, you can do all sorts of things. You can make posters, presentations, logos, do thumbnails, you can do artwork, you can do corporate stuff. There's lots and lots of things. I do recommend just explore it and see what it's about. Um, it comes in two flavors. You've got a pro account, which is a paid for account. And with that, you get access to all the tools and all the graphics, etc. But they do offer also a free account. And with that, there's access to lots and lots of features. So to be honest, that's what we're going to be utilizing today. So first thing we need to do is to create design. So I'll come across to the top right hand corner there and click create design and click video. And just click the advert way. OK, this is our blank video screen. First thing we need to do is create a background. So I come across to the left hand side and click background. And with that, we can either have plain colors or we can have gradients or we can even have some graphics. I quite like the idea of having a graphic. So let's see what we've got. I like that one. Let's utilize that. That's a nice calm effect. So with our background, we now need to add some text. So what we need to do is come across to text here, click text. I'm going to click add heading because that gives us some nice chunky letters. Bearing in mind that our video is going to be playing through these letters. So first of all, we need to do is change the text to something more appropriate. There we go. And then what we need to do is to increase the size of this. So just grab the corners there of that text box and increase it. Okay, and we can just move this across to Get it centered up, and there we go, comes across to the center lines there. If you want to reduce the spacing between those two lines of text, very easy, just highlight both lines of text, click on that little box there, and just decrease the line spacing. So we can have something like that, that's a bit more appropriate, and just again, we can just adjust the positions of that. Okay, to help create a video in text effect, we need to change the text and color to a very, very bright green. So again, what we need to do, is just highlight the text, click the little button there, text color, click green, and then we need to adjust that to a very, very bright green. So click that little sort of add new color dialog box, and it'll allow you then to increase the intensity of that green to something like that. It needs to be a really, really bright green. So there is our basic sort of text box. So we now need to download that and then we're going to upload that into HitFilm Express. So I'll click the download button. It's an MP4 video, so that's fine. And click download and save it to your computer. Okay, so we're now back in HitFilm Express. Here's the new little video that we created in Canva. It's going to move that and drag it across our existing video clip. As you can see there, it's slightly smaller. So all we need to do is do a right click on that little clip, click transform and click fit to frame. This is now the clever part, come across to effects go into keying, go into color difference key, and just drag that across onto our little video. And all of a sudden there, you can see it's made those um, little sort of text characters now transparent. In other words, you can see the video. So now if I play the clip, there you go, that's our text effect. But you can do more than just that. You can actually make these characters animate. So the way we do this, we go back into Canva, so we are back into Canva, just click the text, and you see there we've got an effect called animate. Click that, and there then this is the fun bit. You've got access to quite a few animated text effects, which are free. If you see a little crane symbol, that's part, they're available in the Pro account, so you can't use those, but there's still lots that you can use here. So for example, we've got something like that, or you can have roll, or you can have skate, uh, you can have all sorts of things. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to go for skate. Simply click that. That effect now is built into this little sort of graphics. It's timed at five seconds, but if you click that, you can just adjust it to suit the time scale that you particularly want. So now we're going to download that again, back to our computer. And 
Okay, so we're back now in Hit Film Express. Here's our new sort of animated sort of effects. I'm going to drag that again across to our timeline. Do the usual trick of just resizing it just to fit to frame. Again, we're just going to uh, create that color difference key effect and just drag that across onto it. Okay, so now when we play this, this is what we've got. As you can see, there's lots and lots and lots to play with there. And you can make your video intro really look professional for very little effort, to be honest. And yet, there's even one more trick. And I'm going to show you this because I know you just like these easy, easy effects. So what we're going to do now is to jump back into Canva. And now we're going to create a new effect. So we need to get rid of those. Get rid of that. In fact, no, we're going to keep that. And what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to add a shape to that. So going to elements, we're going to see all. And you see these little shapes here. What you can actually do, you can add some of these shapes and create exactly the same sort of effect. So we're going to grab this heart, place that within our video clip. Let's get it all lined up. There we go. Again, we're going to create that sort of iridescent effect. So I'll just click on the color there, click on to green, adjust it to a really vibrant green color. We're now going to download that. And then we're going to put that back into HitFilm Express. So here we are, we're back into HitFilm Express. So we're just going to drag our heart effect above our video. Again, we're just going to resize it to suit the frame. So just hit transform, fit to frame. We're going to add our uh, color difference key effect. Just drag that across. And there we are. But what I'd like to actually do, what would be really fun, is if this heart grew as the video sort of progressed. So it's a very easy way to do this. Simply just do a right click, do make composite shot. Click on the defaults, they're fine. Click that little triangle, click transform. And we need to find a point in our video where we'd like it, the heart to start to grow. So something like that. Just click scale, so we're at 100%. Come further down your timeline. And now we're going to increase the scale of that so it actually fills the frame. There we go. And if you want to, just highlight both of those keyframe points. Do a right click and hit temporal inter interpolation and smooth. That'll just smooth out the actual sort of graphic itself. Come back, come into the editor. And now when we apply this, we've got this effect. I think this is really good. There's all sorts of effects you can uh, you can make with Canva and with Film Express. And what I'm going to do now, I'm going to show you a selection that I've done just to give you an idea of what you've got to play with. So a nice easy way to add some quite sophisticated graphics to the start of your video clips utilising a combination of HitFilm Express and Canva. Hopefully you found this useful. If you did then hop across to my channel. There's plenty of other sort of videos on utilising HitFilm Express and other great content as well. So as always I appreciate you watching and I'll catch up with you soon.